Good morning, Wildcats. It's Tuesday, March 3rd. I'm Miranda. And I'm Tristan. This is the Morning, morning. Roar. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. To the republic for which we stand. One nation. Under God. Indivisible. With liberty and justice for all. The COVID relief canned food drive has been extended. It is important that you help because the on this district-wide event collecting canned foods and non-perishable foods to help people who are in need during these tough times. You can turn these foods in to your advisory teacher or turn them into the front office. They have a box there. Every little bit helps. Thank you, Tristan. And now, let's go to clubs. HOSA has a mandatory meeting today right after school in Mr. Miller's room. Seniors! If you want to get interviewed and have a senior session, a senior session is when I personally interview you about your time on campus and what your best experience was, who your favorite teachers were, what impacted you the most, stuff like that. If you're interested, please contact me at tedelman2568 at diceartstudents.org. Thank you, Tristan. And now, let's go to Sam with the sports. Hello, cats. My name is Sam, and I'm bringing you your sports for today. Today, there's a basketball game there's a boys and girls basketball basketball game after school against Glendale, and there's also a girls soccer game against O'Connor. On Wednesday, the boys varsity team has a game against Dice Art, and on Thursday, they have one against Independence. Today is the second day of tryouts for boys and girls beach volleyball. Boy, boys tryouts will be held from 6.30 to 8.30 p.m. in the main gym. Please update your registermyathlete.com profile by selecting boys volleyball as your sport and completing all of the online forums. Girls tryouts will be from 4.30 to 6.30 p.m. at the Sierra Montana Rec Center, Sand Courts. Please update your registermyathlete.com by selecting Sand Volleyball for your sport and completing all of the online forums. Email, email Coach Overfelt about either of these sports if you have any sort of questions. And lastly, boys wrestling are having their last meet this Wednesday. We bring you a short story on, on eSports today from Michael E. The upcoming season is going to be a little difficult right now, or what's coming up, because we've lost one of our key players, but we've introduced, found a new player named Pedro. But at that turn, we are just, again, building a new team. But that's all we're striving to do is aim for playoffs again. Well, I think we're pretty well off. We're paired up nicely together where we can work together as a team, and we're not going to have any drama. It's the first time I really see a school do a Madden or a type of EA game for an esports team. I'm kind of excited to. Um, even if you can't play the game, right, and if you're interested in joining, just come join. We're a friendly bunch of, you know, people. We'll teach you how to play, and if you want to come join, just come to the esports room. Or go to Alfred, right? C come find someone in the esports area and try talking to them. Because if you talk to them, most of the time they'll be like, hey, yeah, we can help you out. You know, look for the jersey that we wear. You know, it's just a matter of talking to them. That's all I got for you for sports today, Wildcats. So I'm going to send it back to the desk. Thank you, Sam. And before we go, just a reminder, Penny Wars is still going on till tomorrow, so make sure you bring in your money to help teachers get pied this Friday. We f leave you today with a short public service announcement from Alyssa Holmes and Tyler Tuttle. That's all we have for you today, Wildcats.
Thank you for tuning in.